well, betting firms use schools' data on 28 million yeah, children. Where is this information? This is an from? absolutely shocking story, which probably would have got much more coverage if it hadn't been for Meghan and Harry. So this is an educational database um, that apparently the Department for Education... Um, they disabled this database when they were confronted by the Sunday Times and, and referred the breach to the Information Commissioner's Office. Um, but for somehow or other, there was an arrangement with betting firms um, through a third-party data company that is being used by um, the Department for Education. It's the, the Learning Records Service, which you would expect would only be used for educational purposes. Which is meant to be, yeah. Yeah, but 28 million um, children and students, uh, their information. But, you know, apart from the fact that it's betting, which we know has been in the news under mm. the concerns about gambling and mental health and addiction, but it's also, you know, do we know whether these people... Um, could get investigate or get access to children's data about disabilities or special education needs. I mean, it is a shocking data breach. I mean, one of the things it says in the story is that 12,000 organisations have access to this data. Which is unbelievable. Who are these people? And why? Yeah.